Arthur Jones here. You know, there's something I want to get off my chest. It is this when seeing back last night. AJ, you were the new WWE World Champion. Right, yeah. At the end of the night, Mauro Ronaldo said something to the effect of, does this tarnish your legacy the way you want? You what, being a winner? Does that tarnish my legacy, being a winner? I don't think so. I do what I got to do. All right? I'm a winner. I find ways to win. That's what winners do. They, maybe, you, maybe you go by that. Maybe you'll get a better job. Maybe try that. I'm a winner. You see that? I told you it was going to be my trophy, and here it is. Over my shoulder, one way or another, I am the champion. I am in the history books as WWE World Champion. Thank you, AJ. Congratulations. You're welcome. Yeah, but by controversy, can somebody tell me what makes him the face of the company? When he beat John Cena the second time, he beat him fair and square. He didn't cheat. He didn't use no illegal maneuvers, nothing. But against Dean Ambrose, oh, that was different. He had to hit him with a low blow and hit the Styles Clash to win. <laughs> AJ, you went the face of the company. You just... Ordinary AJ Styles. You are not no face of the company. You got to earn that marker. And so far, you have not earned it at all. Let me tell you something. If D. Ambrose doesn't win that title belt back, John Cena, wherever you are, come back. Stop AJ Styles. This guy's out of control. He's doing just what Brock Lesnar did when he snaps. The Undertaker's hit uh, uh, under, under Peter Street. Paul Heyman had to blah, 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 blah about it. You see, I don't know how worse AJ Styles is. Here in WWE, when he was in T TNA, doing, doing the same baloney there. So, Ange... I hate to say this, but John Cena needs to come back. He needs to come back and reclaim his strong. And if Gene Ambrose don't win that title belt back, he needs to get that, get that title off him as soon as possible. Now, I know that you probably don't want to hear that, but that's me. I love John Cena. He needs to come back and get his strong back. And I feel in my heart it's going to happen. Because he had the face of the company. He still hit the heat. He hasn't even earned it. And you know it. So far, John Cena, he's still the face of the company. He has not earned that moniker. And he will never earn that moniker. When he was in TNA, he was the face of the company. He earned it. He hasn't earned it here in, in WWE. If he did, he would be, be in movies, just like Cena. He would be, be on covers, just like Cena. He would be doing everything, just like, just like Cena and the, and the Rock. Has he had done that, any, any of that garbage? No. No, it was a good, good match, but the way he uh, won it, no. He didn't do that against John Cena when he beat him fair and square. But he didn't want to beat Dean Ambrose fair and square. Explain to me that, Ange. Explain to me that. Well, that's my opinion on uh, on AJ Styles winning. And can somebody please get that Intercontinental title off of Miz because it's really giving me, me a big headache.
Miz, sooner or later the title ring will end. And finally, Heath Slater has a job. But the one person who I'm really proud of is Becky Lynch. Becky Lynch. After all the backstabbing, after, after all the bad stuff that's been happening to her, she has finally won the championship. Congratulations, girl. Congratulations. Now win it. Now, now cherish that belt with pride and defeat all challengers. I'm Mark Lee Jones Jr. This is my backlash review.